All right, we are just a bit from the opening bell here uh, on this Thursday morning, seeing a little bit of a pullback in stocks here, but not really that much movement. That's in part because we're seeing reactions to these individual earnings reports. None of them is sort of big enough to set the tone for the overall market. I want Clorox. I, want, I know you I want, want Clorox. Clorox. Oh, Sorry. I could just keep going on and Clorox. Then, really. And then, well, not oh. every, but, to, but, but you made the point that it's partly the management team's mis-execution here. So you can't apply that to every company in this environment. I went into Target last week, and there's wipes almost down every single aisle. I don't want to go down the toy aisle and find wipes, but it says a lot about Clorox. I guess it does say a lot about Clorox. I love, like, always channel checking. Always. I have Brian no life. Sazi, I have no life. Always, always channel checking. Look, fiscal note is ringing the bell there. Is that company public? having, it just went public. So that explains the, the ringing that it is doing this morning. Um, and then tomorrow, of course, we have the jobs report coming to us. So maybe that will set a little bit more of a decisive tone for these markets because we don't have one today. All right. Well, let's stay on these earnings here. We're looking at uh, Paramount, ticker symbol P-A-R-A, -A, another top trending ticker on the Owl Finance platform. Good quarter for them. Perhaps not really getting rewarded out of the gate by Paramount, but Paramount Plus subscribers, relatively new service. They're now at 40 Three million. Looks like they added 4.9 million new subscribers. That was pretty good. But of course, this quarter looks to be all about the Top Gun effect in that film and movie, uh, that film division, and that really helped that uh, that segment out a lot. Yeah, 1.3 billion dollars in sales Huge. for Top Gun, which is big. Um, it looks like the reason that the stock is down this morning, even though overall numbers beat, is what's going on with ad sales, drop in advertising revenue, uh, which is mirroring what we're seeing at uh, very different kinds of companies. Um, so ad sales down about 5.6% to $2.17 billion. A decline in TV viewership is what looks to be behind that drop there. So yeah. that seems to be why the shares are down. It's another double pen morning, Julie. This is another double uh -oh. pen morning. But also, mm -hmm. I, I don't think the market likes... Uh, you got the sense from Paramount that they are going to continue to invest very aggressively in streaming. So no pullback in investment uh, in streaming uh, like the likes we've seen from uh, over at Netflix. Operating profits under pressure for this business. So interesting to see. And now, you know, in, the, in this context, I believe it's what, tomorrow where Discovery, Warner Brothers Discovery is going to report results or is that this evening? All I know is our, our very own Ali Canal has been all over this story. You're likely to hear a, a lot of layoffs coming from that company as well. What impact does that have on the likes of a Paramount Netflix, Roku, and, and other streamers. It sounds like a major restructuring is about to be announced at that company. Yeah, I think you're right. It's out after the close today. Mm -hmm. um, I think investors here are trying to figure out where these streaming services kind of fit in and which one is going to be the most competitive. You have Netflix coming to market with its ad-supported tier, right? So how many ad dollars is Netflix going to draw away from an already weak ad market, which is reflected in these Paramount numbers, not to mention you know, a lot of the online numbers that we that we heard from. So I think that's something people are trying to figure out. Yes, they added subscribers at a higher pace than expected to 43 million. But 43 million, even though, I mean, I, I get it's a new service, but it's still a lot smaller sure. than. So if I'm an advertiser and I want to get the most eyeballs, am I going to look at a Netflix? If not all of them will, their subscribers will be ad supported. But nonetheless, like if you're trying to make these decisions as an advertiser, where are you going to be putting these ad dollars? And I imagine analysts are trying to, Figure that figure, out as well. Out. Did you see Top Gun too? I still have not seen. I it. have to see it. It's so good. It's yeah, so good. So. Well, bullet, bullet Train's the next one that okay. is on the list, right. right? I'll note it down. All right. No, do you know about Bullet Train? I don't know. Okay, we'll talk about it. All right, fair enough.